I am going to explain about how to create goods receipt in SAP MIGO MB1C MB03. Hope this will be helpful. Mostly people use MIGO. Step 1. Execute the MIGO transaction. Choose a 1, goods receipt process. Choose our 01, purchase order. Enter your purchase order number here. Click on execute button. Step 2. Our material is transferred to the item overview section. Choose posting and document date, recommended T stay as today like its default. Step 3. You can choose on the header level, vendor tab to view vendor information. If you choose material tab, you will see the general material data. If you click on the line item number, you will see several tabs in the bottom of the screen appear and you can choose any of those to view some specific information about the item. Step 4. Check the quantity information in this tab. You can do goods receipt for less than the initial value if you change it. You will still see the ordered quantity in the bottom of the screen. Step 5. The next tab contains information about the destination for the goods. You can see the movement type used for receipt process. Destination plant and storage location. There's also information about goods recipient and unloading point. As well as stock type upon receipt. We can see that this material is going to be posted to quality inspection so it will not be available for use until confirmed to be in satisfying quality. Step 6. You can change the update type for delivery completed indicator on the purchase order. It is set to be automatically updated upon posting, but you can change it if your process requires a different approach. After review of all of the tabs, and after you have assured that your data is accurate, you can flag the items as OK. Now you can post the document. Upon posting, you will see that material document has been generated. Now you can check the material document by using transaction code MB03. Execute the transaction MB03. Enter material document and document year. Press Enter. You can see some basic information about the document and items. Double click the item. On item details, you can see some additional item information. Thank you. Thank you.